purifier dismantling procedure. Loosen the clamp screw, lower the clamping strip, remove the coupling plug, loosen the coupling nut of inlet and outlet pipings, swing aside or move out the inlet and outlet pipings. Use special pin spanner to loosen the inlet pipe. Remove the inlet pipe. The outlet pipe is already swung out. Loosen the nut of coupling housing and remove coupling housing. Remove the bolts or clamps and lift off frame hood. Loosen the small lock ring by a special spanner. Remove the flow control disc and upper pairing disc. Unscrew the large lock ring. Lift out the bowl hood by special lifting tool. Put a piece of wood and force out level ring and oil pairing disc from the top disc. Use special lifting tool to lift out the distributor with the bowl disc. Insert the disc in a suitable cleaning agent. Unscrew the cap nut. Lift the distributor cone using a special tool. Lift out the sliding bowl bottom using a special tool. Unscrew the screws from the bowl body. Ease of the bowl body with a special lifting tool. When the bowl body has come loose from bowl spindle taper, turn the central screw of the tool and lift out the bowl body. As the bowl body is heavy, put a strap through the sludge port and turn the bowl body. Loosen the screws of spring support and remove the screws. Remove the spring support and the springs. Slacken the screws of dosing ring. Lift up the dosing ring using a special tool. Remove the dosing ring. Note. Dosing ring keeps the operating slide intact with bowl body. Dosing ring can also be called as distributing ring. Remove the operating slide using eye bolts. Place the slides with valve plugs facing upwards. Remove the valve plugs and replace the plugs as a set. 